All right, very cool. Uh, listen, we are starting off hurricane season today. June 1st to November 30th is when it runs. And just on time is Tropical Depression 2. Depression is like one stage lower than a tropical storm. Uh, right now, it may strengthen into a named tropical storm tonight or tomorrow, but it's expected to be very short-lived, and the track is taking it away from land. However, uh, we'll be having to watch Cuba, as even though it's going to weaken, still some rain and wind uh, that we'll be watching as we go into the middle of the weekend there. Here, it's all about Poor air quality. Look at this uh, haze that's there. That is uh, because high pressure is just acting like a lid on a pot and just having everything cook underneath it, right? So on a good clean air day, this number should be around one or two. We're at a six right now. Uh, those with respiratory issues, try to limit your time outdoors tonight and tomorrow. Right now it's still 30 degrees, but tomorrow the special air quality statement is still in place for tonight. It will likely be in place tomorrow afternoon, and then we should see the end of this as a cold front is coming through on Friday. Not only is it going to bring in fresher air, it's going to lower the humidity. It's not crazy humid out there. Like, we don't have humidex of 40, but it is feeling like 33 to 35 here over the next uh, day, and then we're going to drop it, and then next Next week, we are in for much more comfortable air. Even temperatures will be uh, coming back to about 20 to 23 degrees. Chance of precipitation. Okay, we have a, a pretty good chance tomorrow if you're Toronto eastward. If you are west of the 416, this chance goes way down. So a good chance that we'll see some showers there and possibly Sunday into Monday. Lawn sprinkler schedule, I would say yes, put it on tonight and keep it on through the early morning. Uh, middle of the day is not when you want to water anyway because it can cause burning of the grass, but also we have that chance for thunderstorms. And like I said, it's only mostly through the east end here of the GTA. We may even squeeze out a couple of thunderstorms. So be prepared to potentially bring in your patio cushions tomorrow for Toronto eastward. It is a much more comfortable weekend. Uh, looks like we're going to stay dry until late Sunday night into Monday.